So this is such a cool story. There's a lot of things I think a lot of people like. Meat, fruit, oh, yeah. cheese. Oh, those are the top three things on my list Tom of things Fergus. that I like. <laughs> yeah, Tom is number four. Right after, what was it, cheese or fruit? I forgot. Hey, Tom. <laughs> I know bacon's in there somewhere, oh, yeah, that's for sure, yeah. you guys. Hey, look who I have with me, you guys. Those Chris's. I got Chris, and I've got Chris. How are you guys doing today? We're doing fantastic. Doing great. How are you? Well, when I heard about what your business actually is, I'm, I'm not a professional charcuterie board maker, but I'm a semi-pro. This is gorgeous, you guys. Holy cow. Yeah, what, what inspired you guys to start this business? Our parties. Yeah, so we, every year we um, have been hosting uh, a bottles and boards party, is which, what we call it, and we put out all of our uh, charcuterie, we have our bakery items, and that's kind of where it inspired us. And then also with being furloughed from COVID last year, and we're kind of, you know, what do we do? Where do we go from here? Well, we love to do this, and we have such a passion for making food beautiful, and that's why we always say hashtag eat art. And from here, it's this is where it's gone. Yeah, let's talk about what we have over here. These are these bites. These are fantastic. Chris, tell me about it. Oh, these are our bruschetta bites. They're perfect for uh, parties. If you're doing, you know, for just a little date night, we offer seven flavors. Yeah, work us the way around yeah, here. Put okay. your finger in there so Corey has a sense for what you're looking at. I'll start at my favorite, which is our newest one, and it's an artichoke spread with sun-dried tomatoes and mozzarella. Uh, pardon me, Parmesan. Uh -huh. uh, of course, we got our classic here, your mozzarella tomato and fresh basil with balsamic glaze. A uh, good one here is our pineapple habanero glaze with bacon and cilantro. Who doesn't love bacon? Yeah, I was just going to say. Uh, here we got uh, one of my favorites. It's goat cheese with apricot jam and fresh pistachios. Corey McCloskey would love that. Well, he will be more than happy to give him some. Of course, here we have our ricotta with honey and delicious caramelized onions. That's a delicious one. Yeah. Southwest flavor. This one's one of the first to go at our parties, of course. It's uh, our fresh guacamole with cotija cheese and uh, bell peppers. And we'll end here on our seasonal, uh, just here for a limited time. It's goat's milk with, drizzled with honey, a fresh nectarine slice, perfect for summer, Milano salami, and our rosemary. Very nice. All right, let's work our way around here. Let's give some folks at home a little tip on how to make your charcuterie boards. Now, what were you saying about this one? This, this is like a one-person one. Yeah, so this is called our Bisbee box, and you can either just get the Bisbee box um, it has one cheese and then one brie bite. Well, let's start building it so we yeah. can kind of explain everything we're doing. Now, you always make it look like art. What are you doing to when you wrap this stuff up? Right. Anything special there? Um, you know, just a little bit of... Just simple folding? You, yeah, exactly. <laughs> one into the next, and that way, when you lay it out, it really looks like art. Fold it over, fold it over. Oh, Center. there you go, a little fold over. So exactly. tell everybody about uh, your Instagram page because from there they can go to your website. Right? Absolutely, you could go to our uh, from our uh, Instagram. You could go to our website. Uh, our Instagram is at dose chris underscore phoenix p h x uh, for the abbreviation, and you, from there you could take a look at all, all of our beautiful creations. Uh, and then head up our website, which is yeah. honestly stepping into blast from the past. We're all about mid-century modern around here, so yeah. you'll instantly get that vibe when you hit our website. I love it. So you guys just got married. How long have you been married now? Since October. Since October. How's that going, Chris? Oh, it's great, honestly. <laughs> you know, a lot of people say, like, how can you work with your husband or, you know, wife or whoever you're married to, you know? And it's, it's honestly been a blessing. It's really nice that we have such a good connection in the kitchen and learning different things about each other. So it's really good for us, you know? All right, Chris, can you come on over here for sure. a second? Hold this mic and uh, explain everything that's in there. And while they're doing, let me just explain to you guys really quick. What, now here's the trick to a good charcuterie board. You get a piece of white bread like this, okay, you guys? Here's, now this is something you're gonna wanna add to your charcuterie board. You actually might. You, you take the crust off, all right? So, cause you know, most kids don't like crust. And you take that soft white spot. No, it's just and so you make gross. A this, look at their faces, Tom. Tom. Oh, no. see, yeah. Look at these. They're guys. genuinely <laughs> thinking. Make a ball out. Of this. It's a they are grossing ball. out. And if you if you if you sneak the dough ball into oh, the no. charcuterie board. You never know. Somebody's going to come by the party, dipping that thing in mustard, and you'll be like, hey, Ugh. someone's eating the dough ball. And you know so, what? Yeah. That's, that's great. Yeah, we're gonna, Tom. Yeah, exactly. We'll have to so just add in there. Yep, there's your tip, you guys. Hey, stick around. We're going to make some cookie dough. They've got all kinds of pastries and things that we haven't even talked about. I love cookies. Yes. Those Chris's. Could yes. Those Chris's. Nice yeah. job, Chris and Chris. And those and white Tom. bread dough balls, those are delicacies. Well, a, when you're five, <laughs> when you're three, and you got like a playground dirt all over your hands too, Gross. so it's like, you know, some sand in there. and Some new uh, spices on your bread. Ah. Well, Tom is with uh, two men named Chris, and they are very talented. They're dose Chris's. You got uh -huh. Uno Chris, add another Uno, and you got dose Chris's making some good Uno stuff, Uno plus Tom. Uno. 
Yeah, they really do. You know, earlier, you guys, they were making this individual charcuterie little tray right here. Imagine ordering a bunch of these for your corporate meeting and just handing this out instead of regular lunch. Just giving them all one of these. Isn't it beautiful? And of course, I would serve it with my signature <laughs> dough ball, put that in there. So then, they, you know, you never know. Somebody might actually snack on that thing. But this whole setup, they sell these as well. So you get charcuterie, the individual, and then these little these little bites, and of course they're cookies. Now we're talking about the sweets. Chris, walk us down the line, because you know I'm addicted to chocolate chip cookies, and you guys have some special ones. What am I looking at here? Uh, same. Uh, we're looking at the cookie that started it all here at the Dose. And the it's big our, one here? The big one. It's our uh, chip chip chocolate rainbow chip cookie. Mm -hmm. We have our gluten-free and vegan chocolate chip cookie here, and our white chocolate macadamia nut. Uh, it's just a little sampling. We offer nine cookies total. Yeah. Okay. So now, one thing I noticed is that there's a lot of sparkling going on here. Did someone spill their makeup on this stuff? What is this? Absolutely not. Our uh, company slogan for us is leave a little sparkle wherever you go. That's meaning kindness. So, of course, we have to leave sparkle on all of our desserts. Yeah. It's our little touch to make your day brighter. I love it. Could you Absolutely. imagine having a party and laying those things out? Everyone would love them. My wife is addicted to brownies, and you got some great ones here. Thank you. Well, of course, here we got uh, the plain. It was, you, who doesn't love? Sometimes you just want a nice, Straight simple bread. Classic comfort food. Straight up. We got caramel with crushed walnuts, and uh, our, our deluxe here, which is our chocolate caramel buttercream with our rainbow chips, caramel drizzle, and rainbow chips. You know we like to be extra around here, oh so gosh. there you go. That's it's the Fat extra. Boy Friday. <laughs> it's <laughs> Fat Boy Friday. I'm all over that. Your cupcakes are spectacular. Thank you. Give us a little round the horn. What are we looking at here? Oh, we're looking here at our vanilla maple bacon. That's a classic right here in the middle. Yeah, like I said, bacon that appears on our bruschetta bites. Classic carrot cake, cupcake, comfort food right here. This gorgeous one is our Hawaiian dream. Uh -huh. uh, got a fresh macadamia nuts and coconut in it. It's delicious. I thought but coconut was poisonous. No, no. I like because the way. Not like, around here. We eat yeah. plenty of it. So. <laughs> I stopped. No, I stopped no. them in their tracks. They both look at me. Like, no, uh, thank you, Tom. <laughs> thank you, Tom. No, and that's with our cherry, uh, cherry frosting. And uh, this is a good classic right here. Our strawberry margarita cupcake. Delicious, perfect for Southwest living. Yeah, beautiful. Now, I think this is really cool. They make their dough to just you can just eat the dough. What am I looking at here, Chris? This is our safe to eat cookie dough. You know, I I oh, grew up loved eating all cookie dough, just come in the pot and just eating it all up. And now we're like, you know what, let's make it so we can eat it. And you know, it's around everywhere, but we crucified it. All right, know? let's, uh, let's yeah. figure out how we do this. So all what right, do we so add now? First, we add the brown sugar. All right. Then we add that. the regular sugar. All right, I can handle that. Go for the butter. Okay, I'm going to let you kind of, is that going to come off there? There we go. We got a little butter going. Over there. A little salt. All right, all the basics for cookies, yeah, exactly. for sure. And you get that whipped up. Now, how can people get a hold of you guys so they can uh, check out? I think your Instagram page is probably the best place to go, huh? Probably the, um, our Instagram, for sure. We are on Facebook. And also, we can, you can definitely just go straight to our uh, website, which is uh, dosechrisaz.com. Um, but fa uh, uh, excuse me, Instagram is probably the best way to reach us, definitely. Yeah. Am I throwing the vanilla in here now? The vanilla in All there. All right. See, I kind of know what I'm doing. I love yeah, chocolate. Perfect. Yeah, chocolate. Okay. Chocolate. Right. Chocolate. And then, right, then you're going to go for right for that milk. All right. A little milk in here. And oh, yeah. So there's no worries about eating this because there's no eggs, right? Right, exactly. Yeah. So that's just going to mix up. Is that the, what's this? Oh, here? that's the salt. It just so I gotta go get, the yep, salt get that salt in there. <laughs> All right, there we go. Perfect. I didn't throw that in there last time. I know. Oh too, gosh, I I thought, Sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I totally blew it off. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, so then from here, you just honestly. We got one minute in this show, so you're mixing all that stuff up. Yeah, so then we just add in the flour. Now, is that a cake flour or is that just basic flour? This is basic flour. All right, cool. But I have... Put that thing on low, otherwise we're all. Oh my gosh, there. I know, seriously. <laughs> Let's just dump some in first. Oh, there you go. And then Very nice. It's Dose Chris's, you guys, and I'm telling you, their charcuterie boards are gorgeous, and these desserts are absolutely delicious. And again, they have this no-bake cookie dough, which I'm telling you, I, just give me a spoon and a good movie, and there I go. Absolutely. So then what are we adding now? Are we adding the good stuff? So then right after this is done mixing, then you add in the, the, our rainbow Let's chip. Let's do it. we got about 20 seconds right. to go. So we add this in. 